Thank you. Well, communications equipment used by first responders in Lane County will get some much needed improvements thanks to $1 million of federal funding. But the state is also pitching in $900,000. KZI 9 News reporter Joey Vaca shows us why these funds and improvements are so important for the area. Wildfires are a major threat to us here in Western Oregon, but we're also up against severe weather events like January's ice storm. And with so many people living out in rural areas, it's extra important that first responders can communicate to deliver the best emergency services. Representative Val Hoyle says she's excited to help bring this money to Lane County to deliver much needed improvements to our communications equipment. She says when trying to get the funding and explaining why it was so essential, one thing that helped show the threats we face here in Oregon was when Canadian wildfire smoke bled into Washington, D.C. And I was able to go to our colleagues and say, this is what our summer is every single year. So what can we do to address the drier, hotter climate? What can we do to make sure that we're not losing millions of acres of forest land? And so it, it kind of brought their attention to what our reality is. But that reality is about much more than just wildfires. So with all we're up against, it's essential that first responders can stay in contact in times of crisis. It is extremely timely. We have to accept the fact that climate change is moving very, very fast with these hotter and drier conditions. And we need to do whatever we can to save lives and improving communication on those front lines is key. Coming up on KEZI 9 News at 6, you'll hear how first responders feel about the updates and how the funds will help ensure the best responses and save lives. Reporting in Eugene, Joey Vaca, KEZI 9 News.